Hi, Chris Sathorsi Worst here. Today we're going to take a look at the Zoller 140 Series Sump and Effluent Pump. The 140 Series is designed for use in residential or light commercial applications and can be used to transfer groundwater or effluent. As a standard, this series offers cast iron construction from top to bottom for maximum durability and heat dissipation of the motor during operation. The legs and underside of the volute on this pump are cast iron, making it ideal for repeated installation and removal for utility applications without the worry of damaging the underside of the pump. Additionally, the underside of the pump volute does feature a screen that will not allow solids larger than one half of an inch to enter and damage the pump. Though pumping solids is not this pump's general purpose, the occasional bit is expected and often unavoidable. With this in mind, Zoller included a non-clogging vortex impeller, which reduces the chances of it getting clogged or bound. A vortex impeller by design is further away from any solids if present to minimize the possibility of any comp contact. For optimal life, it is best to avoid pumping solids with this pump. The motor housing and volute receive a corrosion resistant powder coated epoxy finish. A one and a half inch discharge is standard with these pump models. The 140 series utilizes a three quarter or one horsepower motor depending on 140 or a 145 model and is offered only in single phase in 120 and 230 volts. The motor housing is oil filled for lubrication and cooling and in general, a cooler running motor translates to longer motor life. This pump's motor also features thermal overload protection to further protect the motor. In cases where the pump becomes too hot, the thermal overload protection will temporarily deactivate the pump motor. This pump is offered with an optional dual seal for improved preventative care. The 140 series is rated to pump liquids safely at a maximum of 130 degrees Fahrenheit now this pump also has two plugs on the side of the motor housing for easy drainage and filling of the dielectric oil. The hardware included, as well as the easy lift handle, are all stainless for maximum corrosion resistance. This series is capable of producing a maximum flow rate of about 85 gallons per minute and has a shutoff pressure of approximately 31.5 psi or 73 head feet. As with every Zoller pump, these are 100% pressure tested, submerged, and run before they leave the factory floor to ensure quality and reliability for years of trouble-free performance. We have here the Zoller model E140, which is a 230 volt, one horsepower model. In this, in this example, this E140 model is a non-automatic, which doesn't include any type of control or on-off switch. This pump is available with a wide angle switch for uh, a variety of different applications. The power cord is a standard 15 foot, however longer lengths are available. This would be a great pump to have on the job site for dewatering, just as much as it would be suitable in your home basement for sumps that operate quite regularly. To learn more about this pump or to review the specifications installation guide, be sure to check out our website, rcworst.com. Thanks for joining me today. If you have any questions on what we covered, Please leave those in the comments below and we'll be sure to get back to you. Also, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button for more videos like this. Thanks for watching.